today I'm going to give you a quick overview of lenses and proportionality for finding focal length. I thought this was pretty interesting, so I figured I'd get it on camera. Uh, so here I have a light source set up with, you see that letter F, we're going to project that through this convex lens and shoot it onto this screen over here. Here's the first trick I'll show you, it's how to find focal length, uh, which I think you like. You see that fuzzy image over there? The light's off. Uh, to find the focal length, you adjust your distance from the lens back to the light source until it becomes uh, in focus, crisp. That means that the light's uh, rays are converging right where you want them to. Uh, I'll flip the lights back on. Oh, first we'll, we'll, uh, we'll measure the height here. I'll show you another little trick. So we'll take our, uh, our meter stick over there and get that measurement. And there we go. we're going to use this formula, which is kind of simplified. Uh, a over B equals C over D. And I've already collected all the measurements. So basically, that image on the screen way over there is going to be the same amount larger as it is from the distance from here to the screen. And uh, here's my quick little sketch of this. So if this was three originally, it jumped up to 119 centimeters uh, on the screen. And if this was 15 centimeters from the light source to the lens right here, um, see if we can figure out how, what this distance will be from the lens to the screen, if that makes sense. Uh, so when you do some, some quick algebra, 15 over 3 is uh, uh, about uh, 3 over 19. I'm sorry, 15 over B. And then here, this, this unit B works out to 590 centimeters uh, there. And uh, we check that with the, with the measuring tape. And sure enough, you can read that. That's exactly what we get. Um, so I uh, hope you learned something from this. I thought it was interesting. And um, email me if you have any questions.